Okay, I'm kind of opposed to this one, but I got outvoted here. Uh, we're going to do a little start here on a 1975 LTV Landau. Should be Land Yacht. Yeah, it's a big <laughs> car as you can see. It, um, I don't know when Ricky last drove this car. I do remember him driving it. These guys took it down to the races in Grand Forks, which is about two and a half hours from here. Yeah. The, uh, that North was Dakota. Yeah, down in North Dakota for you people in the more southern states that aren't familiar with the northern states. Nice two door. <laughs> it was a nice two door. Some some fucking asshole, so part of my language here, broke the window out of it. As you can see, Chris Sam going in. That and, really kind of uh, deteriorated. Some rats have been uh, chewing at the interior. And got a hole in the roof now. It's got plenty holes. Uh, what's the motor in this big block or small block? 460. Oh, I think Did Ricky ever have this register or just an ARP seat? Uh, no, he had plates on, I believe. Because this car, I mean, I remember Corey telling us about that they, they, they cut, actually cut the coils on yeah, it. Yeah, Rick and I cut the coils and we lowered it. Coil and a quarter, if I recall. It's a big car. Yeah, she's a big car. I don't know the curb weight on it, but oh, I would say it's probably it, it won't be. It probably 45, 4700 maybe. Yeah. Scrappers love these cars, and so do demo guys love these cars. Yeah. Well, I'm assuming it's full frame. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll go find a battery. We put a battery in already. Oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. I guess we'll see if it turns over then. We haven't got that far yet. Check the oil. Okay. Where's the dipstick on this thing? I know. Oh, right, right there. in the front. We got Casey going on the mini bike, so we put the battery in, and then I was like, oh well. Oh, there's oil. Black. Yeah, she's black. The only thing good about Ford engines, they got the dish. Just like right in the front. Oh, yeah, I guess pull the air cleaner. I guess we put some fuel down there in anticipation that it will start. We have the, uh, oh yeah, we have the fuel here. I'm, I'm honestly going to guess right now for starting 50 50. Because, like I said, this thing, I, I do remember it moving. But that was. I don't know, 15 years ago, like it was a baby. Maybe. Oh, lovely. Oh, yeah. I didn't get past the air filter. They didn't get past the air filter. Hmm. That's great. Well, mice getting anywhere, man. I'm assuming it's a motocraft. Yeah. Four probably. Girl. Probably. Oops. Probably. I don't know what the hell that is. Computer garbage. Air conditioner. Oh, it is AC. Yep. Hmm. Yeah, it's a. Yeah. Motorcraft. Yes. Yeah. Just connect this guy. Get that guy out of the way. Is this thing even? All right, okay, carb moves. Carb moves. I'm not sitting in this seat. Because there's, I think, poop. Possibly. Yeah, there's, uh. Where's Derek? He almost said that. Jungle over here. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm not sure if that's headliner material or crusty uh, from some animal in here. Chris, going to be a combination of both. Could right, be. We'll, we'll be back in a minute. We're going to find some sort of seat cover. <laughs> There's a spare carb in the back. Oh, that's not a good sign. <laughs> Maybe that's why you stopped driving it. Yeah. Well, buzzer worked. Bear motorcraft, four barrel. Uh, we'll just put that back in. Oh yeah, the buzzer's working. Can... Okay. I guess uh, we'll be back in a minute and find something to sit on. Put the fuel down. Oh, that's the, uh, I'll I know. Alrighty, we'll be back in a minute. We're gonna find some stuff. And possibly get rid of these cheap trees. Cheap. Well, there you go, Your Majesty. That way, he's not sitting in some sort of either rat slash mouse feces slash headliner. I think they're bigger than uh, mouse. Are they possibly squirrel or rabbit feces? Yeah. I don't know if a rabbit can get up there. Probably, maybe a coyote. Hope it's not human. Or <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nasty. Uh, okay. It's possible. You think Chris is dropping a dude? Do we have the. the No floors? It's got hideaway headlights. Oh, 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 let's put some gas down her. Oh shit, we don't get a water bottle. Should I get a water bottle? Yeah. Pardon? Yeah, okay, hang on. 
There's uh, one in the back of this Chevy truck with some gas in it. In the old Chevy truck. <clears throat> yeah, the floor seems pretty. Pretty, uh. Holy. Well, with flat tires and you lowered the front suspension. <laughs> it's sitting here since, I don't know, when's the last time? It was a cool car. Until it's sat here. Other places around, well, parts of the other compound here are graveled, but this was just grass, so it made it worse. Make a good demo car. No, I think that engine would be a good candidate for like oh. a, a black 52 Ford, if the flathead was no good. <laughs> We're gonna have to go through another, another flathead, so we have a spare one just in case. So. Hmm. I wonder if this is cool get it. Eh, maybe. If it even runs. Eh, turns over nice, so. 460 and a. Some sort of a hot rod. That'll work. Alright, here's the, the big ass end of this thing. Got the keys. It's a little stiff. Trunk opens. Wow. You know how fresh painted that is. Spare tire. We have uh, cans of Coke. Gas treatment. May have a, a gas problem. And uh, napkins. Not too bad. There's Corey's seat. You're still talking? Yeah, I'm still talking. Trees. Oh, you got gas in it. All right, we'll get out of there and we'll see if this fine automobile will start. Some gas in the in the bowl. Check the accelerator pump. It still is pumping out of the squirters. So you got gas. I don't think you got to pump it. I got nah, don't worry about the brakes. Oh, he <laughs> fired right up. But I gotta say, folks, I wasn't staged by the shit coming out. Not bad for car it's after a long time. Yeah, throw some more down there. Oh, I filled the. Oh, you filled the bowls. Yeah. Should have brought a small funnel. Remember, people, proper planning prevents poor performance. Christopher's planning is no planning. <laughs> yeah, oh, that doesn't make for good videos. And the window's not even cracked. Hey, just think. Maybe next week you'll be driving us to the sobering car show. <laughs> <laughs> is that still on because of the COVID? Problem? Hey, the uh, headlight door is closed. Oh, and on a serious note here, people, is the Silvering thing still on? Yeah. Yes. I was talking to Jeff the other day. Okay. I said no because of the whole COVID crap. Yeah, no, it's on. Yeah, the headlight door's closed. That's weird. They were open a minute ago. Yeah. Maybe it needed va It probably needed the vacuum from the engine. I'm assuming they're vacuum operated. Okay. Let me get out of here. Okay. Not move one. Oh, you're smoking. You're uh, smoking the tires because they're flat. Yeah, you're just spinning. Here we go. See this action. Oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> 
run. Now we can take it to the car show. <laughs> Well, I guess it's dry enough now we don't go over a fire. I'm just worried. I wonder if you try pulling out with uh, my truck a little bit or what do you plan on doing with this? Well, I was going to pull out and just take a picture of it. Did, a, did you try putting the gear? Yeah, it's going forward. It, okay. It's been just the tire, all four tires are flat. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, we don't get the little compressor here. No, it's, it's, it's in the back of your truck. Yeah, it's in the back of my truck. Yeah. It seemed to actually run pretty good. Yeah. How many clicks yeah. is on this thing or miles? Because 75, would it be miles or kilometers? Uh, you're kind of, it's just going to be miles. It should be miles because isn't like kind of the late 70s more? It's on the cusp, I think. Uh, zero, uh, 20, yeah, it's been over. It'd be like 123 or something. It fired right up. It, it literally. We just filled uh, the bowls and. Huh, what size motor is it? 460. 460. I was telling Derek, if this motor is a good motor, you know what we should put it in? <laughs> Mopar. That, that'll get people going with a five for the Ford motor. It's not, it's not numbers <laughs> matching. It's a big deal numbers matching. Oh, oh a big filming? deal. Oh yeah, he's oh, fucking mad. I'll see if I can dig another <laughs> car out then. Hey, tell me how to get connected your fuel. Took it your own little uh, I don't know if it can run off mixture. It was running off it. It was running long enough. Oh, okay. <laughs> I said they, it, I'm assuming that the old fuel probably evaporated out. Because they said you don't smell any shitty fuel. And I said we filled it up and it, and it ran he, he gave some high revs and it, it yeah. was actually a gas. It, who it knows? Was, it might even my nose is pretty screwed right now. Can you guys smell anything? No. Is it smell burn no. gas? No. Also, we probably checked the tranny fluid too. Well, that that tire was spinning, so. Yeah. It's just, a, it's. It's in ruts. Well, if we jack it up. In ruts and flat. You can well, jack we, it up and try putting some blocks on it. Yeah, and at least enough to get it out of here. About half the battle right there. But yeah, it fired up though. Like it, <laughs> but it literally just fired up like right now. Uh, it's just, I don't know it's, where a lot of time ago with the four control box. Yeah, on the side there. Yeah, they always go. Well, you well, I know, because you, remember, you had, you had the green or the blue. I don't know. You bought me a couple. Mm -hmm. I'm not a Ford guy, but I think this motor's pretty cool looking. <laughs> it's one of the cars in here that still has a rad. Yeah, I know, and it's a big oh. one. I think I found my sheep at a Dodge. Just on a, on a, just talking about the brain boxes there, we were going up to Eric's deal to get a car one time. And I remember on the side, I remember Derek, that old black Ford went. So luckily there was an all wrecker there and we went and got one. But after that, then we always carried spare brain boxes because the damn things go at any time. If we went to Regina, near you. Yeah. No problem. Got home the next day, the box went. Yeah. Me and the old man went to Montana there. We took a spare one and we never had problems. But... Well, I hate to say it. We should go maybe jack this thing up, put some shit on the tires and try it up. Yeah, see if we can. I'll call it a day. It's too early. Trying to move this thing, take two. <laughs> I think if we get a rock, we can do it. Yeah. Might be a little windy for you, but. He's got brakes. Hey, hey Shirt, the key off. Take a picture of them. <laughs> this was the floor. Yeah, we got a lighter. We got some nice rust. Why are we getting rid of it? We're gonna take this a sobering car show. <laughs> if the body wasn't so bad, I'd probably say put the throw an R plate on and you could drop it there. Uh, <laughs> It's got plates on it. Yeah, we'll yeah September 04, so you're 
Well, it would start because of 04, that's 18 years. Well, it's like, no, sorry, 17 years. Size does matter. LTD Lando. What is it like doing? I don't know. Big yellow. Uh, what do you even call this? A boat. I, I like how Ford had a land know, yacht. Yeah, land yacht. If you got the kind of the that phony wood grain kind of interior. Mm hmm. Not much fuel in it. That's a good thing. Hmm. Crap. Road maps. Road maps. Ford probably get that. Some viewers might get that. I could do uh, a grass burnout. <laughs> Well, let's go get some gas. Alright, we'll be back, I guess. We'll <laughs> some gas. Ricky's gonna be like, what? This is gonna be... Well, I just know, you know... Turtlicious? You know what you need? You need to have the sound effect with the bomb going down. Boom! Boom! Anyways. Alright, let's go get some gas. There. It does move under its own power. Yeah, we put some gas in it. Check the. Yeah, we actually checked the fluid. I put more oil in it. Put antifreeze in it. Hey, yeah, it's open. That's open. And we pumped the tires up a little bit, but we actually checked the fluids and all that. I can't believe it actually moved. <laughs> Brake lights work. Dual exhaust. Somewhat brakes. It's just a shame that somebody busted that window open. Mm -hmm. Get ready to push it in case it dies. We only put seven bucks of gas in it. All right, man. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing the window's down. Big old 460 has some power still. <laughs> I'm actually impressed about that car. Well, not the car, the engine. 
Looking for the wind, fellas. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Time for it to go back into the bush. Remember people, like share, subscribe. Don't button. encourage these people, folks. Try to be the voice of reason here. <laughs> and he hits the gas can. Well, that was an successful and excitement filled episode. It was a pretty good breakup. Yeah, just that one Corvette. He didn't look too impressed. <laughs> He's a Corvette owner. I don't think the people that buy Corvettes, especially if you want to watch it. It's the oppression of society. We are not in. Ford had more power. Yeah. This is like a pretty low brow. Or no brow. No brow. Anyway, if you like this video, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment. Good one. Give me your advice there, Casey. <laughs> the car is not for sale now. <laughs> what? Yeah, we'll do it again. Just not today. All right, we'll see you on the next one.